You guys, I've been living foul. Foul. Between moving, purging things, getting all my stuff here, setting things up, having an immediate family visit, tearing things back apart, things have been crazy. I figured this would be a perfect video for us to reset, re-energize, get ourselves together, and set things up so that I can feel like the energetic, sprightly, vibey chick that I am. Not this like tired, overwhelmed wreck. I mostly spent August bopping around the East Coast. I was in New York, I was in Philly, I was in Vermont. I was having a time, it was a good time. Actually insert some footage here, like in New York, I just like saw my best friend, saw some people I really wanted to see and vibed out for a few days. Went to Philly, spent so much time with my sister and just really had a good time hanging out and connecting with family and just like eating some fun Philly foods. We went to Reading Terminal with my cousin and my aunt. We did this like the hop on hop off bus in Philly. Uh, it was so much fun. Then Carla and I went to Vermont and. And we just had like sister time, we were in nature, we drove around, we just relaxed and enjoyed like the serene little small town we were in. It was vibes. So I had a project on my way back and I, you know, I sit in my dining room, you guys saw it, it's a video before this one if you want to check it out. Honestly, I've been loving it because I love to sit there and I love like the orientation of the room now, but it made me kind of tear apart like the living space. It's all one big room. So I've spent some time figuring that out. Got a new little credenza in, like I've been setting that up and like just like styling things. And so I feel like the living space is well on our way. My bedroom was the first place that I kind of like set up immediately when I moved in and it was feeling really good. It's feeling cute. Very undone, but cute. So I've been thinking about how can I like re-energize the space. I want it to be calm and serene, but I also like to hang out in there. I love to listen to music in my room, like chill and listen to a podcast. I love to in the morning just like open up the drapes and stare out of the window and just like, so it's kind of like a place where I reset, re-energize, vibe, you know, like it's your bedroom, right? So it's the place where you do those things. I also watch TV in there. We got the goods. I'm loving this color. Okay, thank you so much to Brooklinen for sponsoring this video. I have had Brooklinen sheets for like the last, I would say like three years. That's like that pretty like yellow gold bedding that you saw on my bed in my Domino Magazine shoot. It was also like that striped duvet on one of the beds. So that was all Brooklinen. So I've been using it for literal years. So I like to do a bundle. I like to do everything all at once. So I'm gonna get like pillowcases. We got two pillowcases that come with the bundle. This is the core sheet set. So I did the Lux. This also has one flat sheet, one fitted sheet, two pillowcases. I don't understand people who use a flat sheet as a fitted sheet. Like that's not my ministry. Like it's not a life I can live. I toss and turn. I want my fitted sheet to stay on despite like what a kind of mania I'm giving it at night. So like I like a bundle. It also comes with a duvet cover. And because we're going into fall, I decided to treat myself a little cashmere. You guys, this is so nice, this throw. Wow. Oh my God, look, whoa, I love. That's such a good sign for like a really quality cashmere when the fringe is really thin like this. Like, it's so cute. You can get 15% off your first Brooklyn and order with the link in my description box. And you can even save extra when you bundle. I'm a bundle girl. Honestly, this is the perfect fabric for me because I love like a crisp, smooth, never gonna pill, soft sheet. So we're gonna wash those and then we're gonna do a little more resetting and re-energizing. Cause we deserve. Another little pull myself together moment. If you don't buy yourself flowers, like please do. These are just from Trader Joe's. Like they're just from the grocery store. And honestly, they look so cute. If you think arranging is hard, you wanna get something sort of scrappy like this, you know, like scraps, right? And then you wanna get something leafy. I like this little bunchy guy here. I don't know the names of flowers, okay? Then you wanna get something that pops like the yellow. You kinda can't go wrong. Start building from the back. Think about how it's going to face. So like this side is cuter than this side per se. The eucalyptus makes it smell so good. I also got a lot of favorite snacks and things like that while I was at the grocery. I got plenty of stuff to cook for the week. We are getting it together. I made the bed, but before I can show you how sickening these sheets look, I just remembered, I just 
removed a light switch. We have it all the way dark so you can see. So this was a light switch for some very terrible lights that are above that I had removed. So or am removing. They're like these socket lights. And but like who wants two crazy shadows over top of your head as you're laying in bed? Like that was the only lighting. So I moved the overhead lighting to the other side, got rid of this plug. But what we're gonna do what we're gonna do is a little paint. I happen to have a sample. This is a sample that I bought of the paint for my room. So I was just like, you know what? Shaker good. Let me just grab that and get this little ugly patch fix before I show you the cutest bedding. Okay, we're gonna protect the bed with a random blankety thing that I don't use that I found in my garage. There we go. Safe and sound. I have a mini paintbrush here that we're gonna just quickly pop on. And we're gonna kinda do a rogue because I don't even have a paint tray. So we're just gonna fill this out, you guys. Like what will be will be. And we'll just keep our fingers crossed. Okay, so don't don't do this at home, kids. This is feral behavior. I can't be responsible if you ruin anything of yours behaving this way. This is so out of pocket, like, this is actually deranged. I should do better, but here we are. If your home improvement projects are perfect, shout out to you. I think I need to get a paint tray or something. Or maybe I won't. Is it gonna work? It's low key working. Let's just keep dipping. This is deranged. I cannot believe I'm doing this. When you think it's such a tiny area until you start and you're like, oh, I need a little more paint than I thought. Then a dip. Crazy town. I can't believe it. Oh, and it definitely splattered. So good thing I have this cover here. I am wild, you guys. Do not do any of this. It looks so good. I cannot wait to show you this bed, oh my god. We made the right decision. Okay, we didn't make the right decision about how we painted that patch. That was chaotic, that wasn't even us. Who did that? We don't know, okay? We don't know her, the past is the past. This looks amazing, I'm so excited. Okay, let's, let's show you. Oh my goodness. Do you see what I am seeing, the luxury, like, Cream is also like hard to show up on camera and it's looking good no matter the lighting. We turn the lighting down, it looks good. We turn the lighting up, it looks good. This is so beautiful. What a dream. Here's kind of a full view. That's the little dreamy curtains I was telling you about up here. And then we have like my Dyson LOL because she likes to stay cool while she's relaxing. And then we have some fun art in the corner. Beautiful, obsessed, amazing. My light fixtures. Also, look at these vintage little pillows. Look how I styled it. These vintage bolster pillows. I found them at an estate sale on top of this cream. And do you even see, like, look at the cashmere giving luxury. This is a wood frame I was talking about on the bed. Looks so good, and that's a fluffy rug. All in all, this room is making me so happy right now. Oh my God. I love how this turned out. Like. I'm obsessed. <laughs> I feel so excited to go to bed in here tonight, but not only that, like to chill. I think I wanna just hang out in my room. I wanna create some ambiance. I'm gonna light a candle and put on some music. I have a lot of books in here. So I have like art books on the little console like as decor, but I look at them a lot. So I flip them in and out so I can like always be looking at different stuff. And then I have a bunch of like poetry books on my little nightstand. So I, and like short stories as well. So I think I'm gonna hang out in here and like read, look at pictures. I might doodle on my little iPad. Like I'm gonna give myself a time to just like rejuvenate re-energize, be able to take on the next week coming up. It's Saturday, so I have another full day of relaxation. And now that my room is looking so cute, you're gonna have to drag me out of here kicking and screaming. Thank you again to Brooke Linden for sponsoring this video. Like I said, 15% off your first order. The link is in my description. And yeah, I bundle. This is what the bundle looks like. So I had like everything in place. I'm a four pillow girl, right? So. If you just get like a sheet set, it has two pillows, the bundle has two more, plus a duvet. So you can get yourself looking very cute.
Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you re-energize, relax, rejuvenate, all that re-re-re. I hope you're all in it. Thank you for watching. Love you, mean it. Bye!